Well, hello everyone. This is Kimberly here. Welcome to A Blessed Home with Kimberly Davis. I often share the outside of my kitchen, but today I'm going to take you inside cabinets and drawers on my coffee station. And we're going to get them organized. If you are interested in seeing what I do, just keep on watching. Now this video will be sponsored by Life Wit. Space for your own pace. They sent to me a 25 piece drawer organizer set, which is clear plastic. They're for drawers in your cabinets or your desk or your dresser, wherever you can use these to organize your space. And I'm super, super excited because once you see this drawer on my coffee station, you'll know why I am in need of these. Now you can customize your drawers your own way. This 25 piece set of trays come in four different sizes in which you receive a three by three by 2.1 size and you get eight pieces of them which are these You get nine by three by 2.1. You re will receive six of them. You also will receive three of the nine by six by 2.1. And you will receive the six by three by 2.1. And you will receive eight of them. These materials are clear and transparent as stunning crystal. These plastic drawer organizers light up your drawers and make space for neat organization. The transparent design lets you quickly find what you need when you need it. It's versatile use. All 25 pieces can be easily assembled the way you like it, designed to adapt with all drawer sizes and space. Perfect for storing makeup, pens, stationery, jewelry, and more and they are easy to clean. A simple gentle wipe or a quick water rinse gets dust and dirt off of the drawer organizers, keeping them clean always. So right now I'm gonna take you into this drawer, which is much needed, okay? Look at this hot mess. OMG. Everything is just thrown in here. No organization order whatsoever. But we're going to change this. So let me get this all cleaned out. And we're going to put these Life Wit organizers to use. So 
So let's see how we are going to configure this drawer. I'm gonna start with these containers here. Next, these. So I have the drawer organizers placed in my coffee bar and I still have containers to use and will use in another space. So stay tuned for that, but we're just gonna concentrate on the coffee bar itself. One of my favorite coffees, the salted caramel. I've stocked my hibiscus tea. My hubby's favorite coffee which is Colombian. And I have a few of my fall in love fall blends left that I still love to use. So I'll put these in here so I can use the last few up.
switch that around so all my tea items will be together. And I'm keeping it that simple and it looks neat. I had other items in there that I really wasn't using, so they will go. So let me take you in for a closer look to share with you how neat this looks. Loving it, loving it. Have in this drawer exactly what I will use. Nothing more. And I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. So I would like to thank Life Wit for the opportunity to work with their company. If you are in need of some organization storage solutions, um, you need to check out Life Wit because they have so many, so, so many products that will help you get your home organized and in order. I will have a link to the company and a discount code for my blesties. Get your house in order, y'all. <laughs> That's my focus. So I'm gonna continue on. Now this door here is a hot, hot mess. I am going to grab a box and see what I can purge and go from there. Stay tuned. All right, I've grabbed a box, so we're going in here and this is a hot mess as well. Everything has been thrown in here. Look at this. <laughs> it is a hot mess. I'm actually scared to pull this out, but we're gonna do it. Oh, M, I can't even pull it out. <laughs> so guys, I have things in this pull out drawer as well as down below all right so i'm going to get to it and start emptying it out seeing what i have in here seeing what i can purge what i need to keep and we'll go from there So guys, I didn't put very much in the box, <laughs> but it may end up being full. These cups here, uh, my boys, when they go to the theme parks here, Disney and Universal, they and movies, different movies, here I am dropping a top. Um, they bring these home and they have tons of these. So um, I don't know where they're keeping their other ones, but these will go where the other ones are they're not in my kitchen <laughs> so those will go where they are um so now i'm just going to organize this and put just my necessities 
my ninja will definitely go back in here in this drawer in its place <laughs> and it has uh like suction cups that's why i'm struggling and it's heavy come on <laughs> do it like this there it is it's heavy i will probably get a bin a clear bin i probably have one i'll check in a minute so I could put these in here as well because this is not going in here right with the lid on it. It's too tall. And I'm sure I do have a uh, bin, a clear bin for that. All of that copperware that you saw is not going back. I'm keeping it, but it's not going back in here. Down here would be basically my signs, my Keurig cup holders, and maybe like the shelves uh, or the mug stands that you see will go down here. Everything else, <laughs> going bye-bye. So stay tuned, let me get this together and then I'll share with you what's down here. So I'm going to take you inside the upper portion of my cabinets where my mugs are stored. It's not too bad in this space here, but I need to tweak some things, just a few things. So once I tweak them, I'll share with you everything on this coffee bar or coffee station beverage bar stay tuned so before I share with you the inner portions of this coffee bar let me share with you how the top of my coffee bar is looking at the moment I'm gonna do a little refresh on it change a few things out all right guys i have everything pretty much like i wanted i'm gonna take you in to my coffee station i'm gonna start at the top and work my way down here's all of my mugs i had to wash up a few and organize some at the tippy tippy top now I want to level up my mug game. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I want everything to match pretty much. I'm loving the black and white. So I'll mainly be um, purchasing some black and white. You'll probably see touches of gold and white. You may see some touches of silver and white. And of course I have to keep my red mugs because my favorite color is red. But I'm going to be mainly on the lookout for some mugs for my coffee bar slash coffee station. I'm going to take you in closely.
I'm loving this here. That will not change. Not so crazy about all of this, so I'll be working on that. Um, have a few mugs here as well. I do have a mug here from one of my faithful uh, blessed family members, Leone. So hi Leone, I have that mug right there and I do use it. So you see all of my black and white mugs here. My mother in love gave me and my hubby these mugs and I love them as well. Mr. and Mrs. back there. Love those. Love, 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 love. Love those. So that is my mugs. I'm going to take you down to the pretty. <laughs> And I really didn't uh, do much. I just changed the canisters out on my coffee bar. I had some bunny canisters and I changed them to these. These are some of my favorite. I also changed my mug stand out to this one here that I bought, I think, last year from Home Goods. They had different mugs on them, but I changed it to these. I absolutely love that stand. The metal piece that you see hanging on the wall, I did a DIY on. It's actually a candle holder that I added <laughs> bling knobs to because I wanted it to be a wall piece instead of a candle holder. And I'm loving it on the wall. And the picture here was a recent purchase and was in my last haul from Home Goods that I had to have. I love that beaded handle as well as the gold and the white. I just have some peonies flowers from Amazon in the picture. So I'm loving that using it as home decor instead of serving a drink with and <laughs> lastly I have some treats I had to put these out because my grandson is having a fit he wants these cookies <laughs> so I said I better go on and do these this video so he can get to them and my son one of my sons came home with some Krispy Kreme donuts so uh, We'll definitely be eating this with uh, tea or another cup of coffee or, you know, any beverage that we want to have today. This is the countertop of my coffee bar, keeping it very simple. Now I'm going to take you in. The inside of this cabinet now this door right here is a dummy door it does not open it is nailed shut because of the space is so so small in there um, hubby and I did a DIY on this coffee bar where we installed um, this chiller on our own and um, I love it I love that chiller and the chiller is from New Air. So let me show you the drawer and how it ended up being. I'm loving the drawer dividers from Life Wit. Um, have everything in its space. Everything so organized. And I'm loving it. And I'm looking forward to using these drawer organizers in other spaces um, I was gonna say in my home but it will be most likely <laughs> in the kitchen so I'll be coming to you with another organizational project using these dividers but I'm loving the drawer I'm gonna take you in to 
<laughs> the door down below. And guys, I don't have much at all in here now. We'll pull this out here. This is all I have in here. I added those containers there to house my ninja um, needs. <laughs> the cups and different components to it. That's the ninja. And you know, I, I still have a little space here. But I don't think I'm going to crowd it up. All right. These are the things that I need for my Keurig to clean it. Uh, filters and the rinsing pods right there. Um, when I fill my canisters, if I have extra, this is where the extra sugar and cream go. And that is it in this pullout drawer. All right. That is it. And I'm loving it. Loving it. Now I am going to um, get some contact paper to put down below here. But as you can see, I hope you can see it. Let me see. I have my Keurig holders in silver and in black. I have my coffee station signs that I absolutely love to decorate with. And my mug stands. I have two mug stands um, that I love. Have them laying down below. And that is it. That is all I have stored in my coffee station. And I'm loving it. It feels so good to have everything organized and in order in this space. And guys, stay tuned because I will be bringing you along in my, in my kitchen because I plan on touching every cabinet, every inch of this kitchen until I have it organized like I want it. And I must say every inch of my home like I want it. <laughs> I'm gonna touch everything. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna take you along for the ride as I organize my home in 2022 don't forget to like comment share subscribe follow me on all of my social media sites and shop my amazon store thank you so much for watching you take care you be blessed and i will see you on the next video love you guys have a blessed beautiful day please be safe out there and I will talk to you real, real soon.